a woman, it's hard to see the people of my nation die for seeking freedom. Some Dawson College students in Montreal are cutting locks of their hair Thursday in a public and symbolic gesture of support for protesters in Iran. Iran remains engulfed by anti-government protests following the death of 22-year-old Masa Amini, who was allegedly arrested for violating the country's strict dress code. Many are showing support for her and others like her. In Iran, you know, you have to cover your hair because you're a woman, because it makes other people um, uneasy. And so the cutting hair is kind of like cutting the people's hand off from having that power over you, that you need to cover your hair, that you don't, you cannot sing and all of this. It's more of a symbolic thing that is showing that we are trying to be free. Some Iranian demonstrators have publicly chopped off pieces of their hair in protest, creating a global trend in solidarity. Students here in Montreal are now joining in. Everybody deserves to have a choice to cut their hair, to do whatever they want with their body. It shouldn't be something discussed by the government other than the person who owns the body. Injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere. Uh, that's uh, Martin Luther King and uh, Oh yeah, that's what I have in my in my heart. And that's why I'm cutting my hair. The initiative brought on by students of Iranian background doing this for friends and family back home. It makes it hard that I'm here and I cannot fight next to them, but it also gives me a chance to have this platform and help them out here by spreading the news. The only thing we can do outside to support them is to echo their voices and to make sure they don't die down. Uh, that applies pressure to the Islamic Republic and also pressure on the Canadian government and other governments to take more action to help with this issue. Emotions ran high when Iranian students let go of their locks. It's not just the protesters in Montreal, Vancouver and people going on the streets that care about this. It's people in colleges and universities. We're the youth and we care about freedom, standing here in solidarity with the Iranian people because we care about freedom, women's rights and what goes on beyond our borders too. In Montreal, Alicia Rubertucci, City News.